Hey guys, what is going on? Today I'm going to be doing a full review on Winscribe VPN. Um, I'm going to show you guys the application um, and show you guys how it works with Netflix. Do uh, some new torrent, uh, down, uh, torrenting download speed tests. And yeah guys, so let's get right into it. Um, by the way, if you are interested in purchasing um, Winscribe VPN, I'll leave some links down below where you guys can get some coupons and save some money guys on Winscribe. So here we are on the website. Let's go ahead and check out the pricing. Um, and yeah, I do remember. Yeah, so the pricing is actually really cheap, guys, compared to um, other VPNs that I reviewed. Like ExpressVPN is like twelve ninety five a month, and Winscribe is only nine a month. So it's actually a lot cheaper, guys, compared to other VPNs. Um, and the yearly plan is only four dollars per month, so it's very very cheap compared to other um, VPNs for sure, guys. And uh, yeah, so now that we've looked at the um, prices, they also have student student discounts and uh yeah guys so they have a bunch of servers as well um and here are the ones that you can unlock when you get the pro they have a free version but you lose out on a lot of servers so yeah guys let's go ahead and actually take a look at the application right here and as you guys can see here it is winscribe pro um i've got it opened and i'm connected to the las vegas one and yeah they actually have a ton of servers to choose from just like most vpns um not as many as other ones though that i've seen i've seen ones with like tons more countries fake Ant Ar antarctica that's pretty weird <laughs> um and let's go ahead and check out the preferences as you guys can see here are some settings that you can check out you know proxy um connection so most of the normal stuff you know nothing too like crazy and customizable um firewall on so you can keep that on if you want to stay um, disables all internet connectivity if you're not connected to our network so you can keep that on it's kind of like a kill switch and yeah guys so that's the application now with Netflix though I've had some issues um, with this VPN I wasn't actually able to connect at all to like any shows I tried multiple servers um, you know Las Vegas I tried like a bunch of USA servers I tried Canada and I kept getting proxy errors when I tried to load into movies or TV shows so I don't think Winscribe VPN is really that efficient for Netflix. Um, it, it's getting caught. It's getting um, noticed by Netflix a lot, um, so it's obviously detectable. Um, so if your main, uh, like the main reason you want a VPN is for Netflix, then I don't think Winscribe is a good option in my opinion. You know, you've got better options like ExpressVPN, Surfshark. Those all work really well with um, Netflix. And I've made videos on all that, so you guys can check out my channel and see those videos. So yeah, it didn't pass my Netflix test, guys. Um, unfortunately, um, but yeah, guys, let's go ahead and check out, um, the uTorrent download speed test. So I, right here, I have uTorrent. I'm going to go ahead and start up, um, a torrent download and let's see how fast it connects. Um, so as you guys can see, it is downloading at 100. Let's see if it goes up to megabits because when I did another test with a VPN, um, all right, so it's actually pretty good. I would say so it's going up to, let's see if we can get it to one megabit. And boom, it did. All right, guys. So it is pretty decent in terms of the speeds while downloading torrent. So that's good. Um, uh, and that's pretty much it, guys. So I covered Netflix. That doesn't really work too well with this um, application or this VPN. Once again, guys, you can take a look, look at the application. And once again, if you want to purchase it, I'll leave some links down below. And in terms of all the VPNs I've reviewed so far, I don't think Winscribe is the best. It definitely is the cheapest that i reviewed so far. But, in, you know... A lot of people use uh, VPNs to watch Netflix and, you know, like Disney Plus and streaming um, and trying to get shows that are not available in your geographical location. And if a VPN is lacking in that field, then I don't really rank it too high because lots of people want VPNs for that reason. So unfortunately, Winscribe VPN is probably not the best option if you want Netflix, guys, but it's still a solid VPN if you just want to surf the web and stay safe and download torrents. It should get the job done. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. Please leave a like. Uh, let me know what other v VPNs you want me to review. And thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.